that time I was like I don't know what to say I was feeling very bad and the first thing I do is that I call my dad and I told to him that I had this problem and I had to go on a, under surgery and all and while saying that I literally felt like crying like uh, like I just came from a new club like I just got transferred and uh, thinking that I have to go surgery and I have to wait for at least one year to play my this uh, all the process and all then I felt very bad Around two and a half months I was there in Chennai and that time first uh, I met uh, is like Tiami Mem like she was the physio so I was working with her around more than one and a half months I think so she helped me a lot before like she was like the professional physio I uh, was working with uh, after my this um, surgery and then I met uh, uh, the uh, sports scientist Shivani Mem then she also helped me a lot like uh, and all the process everything was done in uh, not everything was not almost done in Chennai also but the club wants me here in Goa so I got a, like uh, the tickets everything to come to the Goa so after then I came here then I met Banky sir and then everyone the players everything and the one who helped me uh, a lot all the uh, Yabi and Benki sir. I was all the time with Miss one and uh, two months almost I was with them spending time with them working with them and I came to know with them properly also I was very close to them also uh, when I started first jogging and all I was like limping I was scared then I was not able to run properly then sometimes I feel like uh, um, how will I compete with my other teammates, with the other players, even if I can't, uh, even if I can't joke properly and all. Sometimes these thoughts kept, uh, kept on coming. But the thing what I did that time is like I spoke to myself, I speak to myself every time that uh, before three months I was not able to walk properly and now at least I'm able to joke and do some exercise and all. He met us again directly in August. Uh, First week, uh, I was uh, quite uh, <laughs> very much disappointed with his, with his improvement because uh, the knee was uh, like uh, limited with his knee bending and uh, the muscle also quite weak on comparatively with the uh, normal leg. And you know, when I went to Kolkata, um, the people asked me, the fans, everyone, my friends asked me, you are in the squad and why you are not playing? So like, it uh, doesn't feel, even me sometimes I don't feel good and I am tired of explaining to them that I am just in the squad and then I cannot play and all because I am not fully fit and all. But that one month in Kolkata it was uh, like a very good thing for me, like very very good thing in my uh, process of recovering because in that time I got more time with uh, Benki sir and Yavi coach and with the team doctor also has come so um, the most of the recovery that I did was in Kolkata. Durant Cup uh, helped us a lot because we were indoor and closed inside the hotel and uh, we had a good gym over there and uh, like morning and evening we were uh, uh, treating him and as well as uh, uh, a lot of strength exercise we were uh, giving on him and uh, tracking about his uh, injury and the progress of the injury. When he, when he arrived to us in the precision, he was lack of, of rehab, so, so we started with him, Benki and, and Doctor started with him and, and we made the, the first part uh, like a physiotherapy because uh, he could enjoy the team because, uh, you know, it's uh, big problems trying to, to train with the team. So we made the first month with him like a, like a physiotherapy and after when, when we travel to, to Kolkata, we start with him like half physiotherapy, half rehab with the fitness coach, with me. And he was doing very good, very good. But you know, the problem with him was the lack of uh, good physiotherapy during the first six months after the surgery. Before I do any training, any hard training and on, uh, Bia Mem also, all the time she used to talk to me, she used to motivate me and she used to give me confidence to go in the field. And so she also helped me a lot during my days in, the, in my mentality. So it's a good thing for me and then after I came back to Goa then the first time I go back to training like I was very excited. I was very excited because like uh, being like uh, for 10 months not playing with the team and all and it's like I almost forgot playing with the team because it was a long time so I was very happy and before the training also I was very excited and after the training also I felt really good. I spoke to Javi, I told him I 
feel really good today. I feel I was very happy. And then slowly, slowly, I started training with the team, and I do my own gym sessions with Javi and Benki sir also. And then, and then I get more confident, and I started get uh, getting more fitness training with the team and all. And I was like literally asking Javi every time that when I'm gonna play my first match, when I'm gonna play my first match. He said, Yeah, you play. Don't worry. Let's don't rush things. He's a very good boy. If I ask him always, hundred sixty percent to give, he gives his hundred percent. And in fact, I have to tell him like always uh, go slow, go slow because he's very much uh, uh, young, uh, like motivated blood. He's like uh, you can see him on the field also. He is like very enthusiastic and he always is he gives more than 100 percent. And then that day finally came that match that against Bangalore. Yabi told to me that tomorrow you are playing on 2F, you are playing. So literally, I was thinking how I'm gonna play, how I'm gonna do, how I'm gonna play with my teammate. This is my first time after almost one year. I was very over excited, and I talked to like Beckham M also, and she told to me like be confident, don't worry, just be confident, do everything what you need to do. Even I remember the first day when he was when I asked him to uh, uh, jog, he was limping and you know he's I mean uh, uh, like uh, drawing his leg like you know not uh, he could not be able to give hundred percent. And now you can uh, see him. He was uh, very much improved. The most important thing is like I feel really good to be back on the field playing with my teammates, enjoying what I love to do. So I feel really good, and I was very happy, happy and looking forward to play more matches in the ISM. Slowly, slowly, step by step, he's doing very good. He's uh, he's a very hard guy. He's working hard in the mornings, in the evenings, he's uh, in the day offs. He he came here also, so so he's doing very well. I hope he will have a very good, fantastic season as like before the pre-injury level. He is almost retained his pre-operative level fitness and I wish him and for to have a very good season.